welcome to Card for the Day by Healing Hand Services. My name is Julie Sean. Today is Tuesday, the 22nd of June, 2021. And I have been drawn to use the deck Healing with the Angels Oracle Cards by Doreen Virtue. So I'm here with my feet on the floor, connecting with Mother Earth, connecting with Father Spirit, and calling in our angels, our archangels, our spirits and guides, our gods, our goddesses, sending master ancestors and elementals, and asking them to step close, to be near with us to let us know what information what knowledge what wisdom what insight do we need to know for today so calling in everyone thank them for being with us and i shuffle the cards oh and one completely flipped over as you can see <laughs> and it's miracles miracles are working around us all the time. I mean, it's a miracle when you think about it, that we're on a little ball of rock floating around this a big immense space with other balls of rock, one of fire, the sun, one of cold, the, the moon. And we've got on this rock, there's oxygen for us to breathe. Um, <laughs> there's water for us to drink. I mean, it's so when you think of that amazing miracle and the, the miracle that you're actually here now today, on the 22nd of June, 2021, woohoo! I mean, that's a miracle. Life itself is a miracle. Um, and so when we start thinking about it, then it's a miracle when you watch the flowers bloom and grow, the trees, the leaves, you see all the different birds, the diversity of things that are on this planet. I mean, it's a miracle that we're all here anyway. Wow. But the angels let us to know that the miracles are available for us if we tap into it and that we put everything up to the universe and that they will create the miracle that we're asking for. But we need to keep faith and we have to trust our angels and our guides because the miracle they are giving us is what we need rather than what we want. Because we human beings have their own free will. We are led by um, human, the, the media. We're led by money, communal, uh, uh, you know, all the um, products. You need this, you need that, et cetera, like that, which is a very heavy thing. And what they want to do is they give us miracles that will raise our vibration that is all full of love because our angels and our guides and the spirit angel. They just love us unconditionally. So the miracle you're asking for, as long as that is for your highest good for yourself and for others, and it's coming from a place of love, they are working on your miracles. Now, unfortunately, when people go, well, I want the miracle and I want it now. Unfortunately, angels have been around here for the millennium, And to them, time is nothing. To us, yes, we have a gain for control. We have said this year lasts 365 days and then we split it into 12 months and each month is split into a week and each week is split into a day. And the day is split into 24 hours, into 60 minutes and 60 seconds. And we split it down to control it, to control. You can be here, you can be here. If you ask a tree or ask a bird, what day is it? They just go, I don't know, I think it's warm. <laughs> you know they don't know but we control it and we always want something we want it now we want it now and if I come people come to a reading they go when's it going to happen and I go oh roughly two months so two months from now will be August but then at the end of uh, September to July August September so I say September but then of course September has got 31 days but then what happens if it happens on the first day last day of August or the first day of October. Then they go, oh, they told me it was going to happen in September, but it happened. The thing is, we we put things we we put things into compartments about time, and the angels and spirits and things don't work like that. So when you say when's it going to happen, you go roughly three months. It could happen exactly in three months time it could happen in two months and 29 days or it could happen in three months and one day because we have assigned a time to something but the spirits and angels they are just working with the miracle and when it's the right time for us and we have to learn patience patience but it's the right miracle so what is it that you want that you think is going to be a miracle it happens what you have to now do is rather than go, oh, it's going to be a miracle if it happens, <clears throat> you will now work on the law of manifestation. My miracle is happening and it's happening now. 
because that's all we actually have is this exact moment in time. We don't have yesterday because it's gone. We don't have tomorrow. We're creating our tomorrows. But we only have now. So when you're wanting a miracle, you imagine it, you feel it, you taste it, you hear it. And you go, yes, this is what's going to happen when I have the miracle. And the miracle is now, the miracle is now. And you put it up to the universe. Right, this is my miracle. This is what I want. And I have it now. Because that's all you want. Because if you say, oh, I want it sometime in the future. When you get to that date, say, oh, I want it on in, in the future in, in two weeks' time. In two weeks' time, it's going to be another two weeks. Okay? And there'll be, because you keep saying, I want it in two weeks' time. But when you get to that two weeks, it's going to be two weeks time if you understand where I'm coming from. So you need to sort of imagine it's now because you keep saying oh, I'm going to have it in two weeks time. When you get to two weeks time, that time is now the here and now. Yep, you're on that here and now. When you get to tomorrow. Tomorrow is Wednesday. You go, oh, well, I'll do it tomorrow, tomorrow. When you get to tomorrow, OK, it's Wednesday, but it's not tomorrow. It's now then becomes today. And what was today is then yesterday. So what you have to do when you're wanting a miracle, imagine you have it now. Feel it, breathe it, taste it, smell it, sense it, live in it and put it up to the universe because the angels are producing that miracle. What is it you want? Remember, it's got to be positive, full of love and is of higher benefit for yourself and doesn't harm anyone else. And that miracle will come to you. I do hope you enjoy this message. If you have, don't forget to like, share and subscribe. If you'd like to have a reading with me, don't forget to contact me. You can contact me via the comments below. Have an amazing day visualising your miracle. Wonderful. Take care. Namaste. Bye.